Hi, my name is Adeline, and I'm a post-baccalaureate fellow at the National Institutes of Health. Our immune system works 24-7 to protect us from disease-causing invaders like viruses and bacteria. For people with autoimmune disease, their immune system actually causes them harm by attacking the body. Juvenile dermatomyositis, or JDM, is an autoimmune disease that affects a few thousand children in the U.S. Kids with JDM frequently experience symptoms, including skin rashes and muscle weakness. Kids with JDM can sometimes feel so tired that they struggle to do everyday tasks, like dress themselves. Currently, we don't understand what causes JDM, so it's difficult to come up with good treatments. Currently, kids with JDM take medications that broadly affect different parts of their immune system. Because these medications are not specifically targeting the cause of JDM, there are also a lot of potential side effects. Of course, finding the specific cause behind a complex disease like JDM is a little bit like looking for a needle in the haystack. To help us solve this problem, my lab used a technology called SomaScan to measure the levels of over a thousand proteins all at once in the blood samples of patients. From this, I have identified dozens of proteins with higher or lower levels in patients in comparison to healthy kids. Next, I hope to relate these levels of proteins in a patient's body to their symptoms. This could help researchers in the future see if a new treatment that they are testing for JDM works. Clearly, our proteins have a lot to tell us about complex diseases like JDM. To improve the ways in which we understand disease and improve treatment and diagnosis, I think we should listen to what our proteins have to say.